Municipality condemns fake news regarding payment holiday. The Itikwini Municipality's Communications Unit Acting Head, Masekwe Maisele, stated that residential and business utility accounts will be invoiced as normal. However, the municipality will not disconnect customers during the lockdown, as stated by the mayor last Thursday. Are you aware that the Itikwini Municipality during this lockdown period will not disconnect you if you in areas? Yes, we are aware of that, but there's been many problems because uh, most of my neighbors and stuff have been, uh, lights have been cut, so we have just been accommodating them with uh, making their food out, warming their, uh, doing some of the ironing. Some of them are essential workers as well. So we're trying to help them, but the municipality is not playing the game. So we want to know what's the next steps, because there's so much we can do as a community to help them. The National Prosecuting Authority will also be requested to consider an amnesty or discount on traffic fines, as there will be several roadblocks and we do not want residents to be inconvenienced. During the period from March 26 to April 16th, 2020, the municipality will abide by the lockdown. Quite trying time for everybody, but uh, I'm sure they will they'll come with a cure and you know everything will be well again. And after, it's just a bit of worry after the lockdown period. You know, as we go back to our normal lives, if everything is going to go back to normal, we just pray and we just we are thankful and grateful to the government for all the assistance and everything is doing during this trying time. Silver Glen physician, Dr. Perry Swami Nila Pitambaram Gavinder, is in his early 90s. And despite him being in the category of our most vulnerable to coronavirus, he is at the forefront of the health catastrophe. Practicing as a medical doctor in Mirbank for over 55 years, Dr. Gavinder is assisting in the fight against the coronavirus, as well as many other health issues faced by his patients. While the doors of numerous medical practices closes due to fears of not effectively curbing the spread of the virus, Dr. Govender remains open to the public at stipulated times. As I say, life's a journey, you know. It starts with birth, it ends with death. It's like you're in a capillary tube. And there are many ups and downs along the way. This is one up, one down. It is... Uh, Something we don't know, it's unknown territory. <laughs> As doctors, we are also groping. So what we are doing in this party internationally, it's accepted that once you are not certain, then you need to take precautionary measures. The precautionary measures our president has already announced. He was also instrumental in setting up a medical camp in Westcliff during the xenophobic attacks in 2015. The father of four says he will continue to provide medical care to his patients for as long as his health allows him to, and offered precautionary measures for residents to follow in order to stop the spread of germs and coronavirus. So tell us about why you're not concerned about your age playing a factor in the fight against coronavirus, you being the most vulnerable. I'm, vulnerable. Mm -hmm. I'm at high risk here. So, so, if you come to me as a young child, I call you a child in comparison, I'd rather save you, even if it means at the expense of my life. That's how I look at it.